Okay, our last stop and jot for the oral language module. Grab your module four handout and let's go. Previously, we explored the value of strong teacher and student talk within a dialogic classroom. And now let's recap a few of the instructional strategies we learned about that help support engaged discussion. Read alouds and book discussions provide opportunities for students to hear rich language, to develop an understanding of book language, and a sense of how words are put together as they become familiar with language patterns and structures. Strategies such as retelling and storytelling, show and tell, and sketch to stretch help students develop expressive language skills as they share and receptive language skills as they listen. Elaboration is a strategy teachers can use to extend and sophisticate student language and allowing students to participate in frequent conversations through a variety of engaging strategies provide them with time to practice the oral language skills they are learning. This module taught us so much about the what, why, and how to help students develop their oral language skills but we also need to remember the importance of assessment so we can continuously assess oral language development over time. This continuous assessment can be done in a variety of ways, but two key ones that were discussed included the use of checklists used in formal one-on-one -on -one settings or through informal observation and audio recordings make it easier to capture the oral language skills being assessed. So. That wraps up our final stop and jot, recapping the key ideas behind oral language, instructional strategies, and assessment of oral language development. Wow, you have explored a lot of content in this module. This wraps up our final stop and jot for module four. Remember to take a moment and think about these big ideas and how they relate to your classroom instruction.